Hey everybody, today we have Buffy, the Vampire Slayer, and her lover, who then couldn't be her lover no more because he turned into Angelus Angel. When he got true happiness, he turned evil and stuff. Um, yeah. Angel, which I always liked Angel better, and he had a spin it all show. Uh, so, yeah. Anyway. Buffy is a reluctant hero. Buffy Summers is called to be a slayer at the age of 15 after an incident at her high school in Los Angeles, which is what Buffy the Vampire Slayer, the movie, is about. Her mother moves them to Sunnydale, California. She becomes the guardian of the Hellmouth. As a slayer, Buffy possesses superhuman strength, speed, healing factor, and incredible Endurance, she also displays a great deal of combat prowess when battling vampires. And then Angel is one of the most renowned vampires in all of vampire history, legendary for both his ruthless villainy and his brave heroism. Originally born in Ireland in 1753, he is known as the demon with an angel's face because of his physical beauty. In the late 20th century, Angel becomes an ally and lover to the fierce slayer Buffy Summers. Alright, so these are best Axiom figures. Um, they had I bought them at the toy show. I got them for five dollars each. Uh, they had three different Buffies, but they all had the same weapons. They all had the same extra hands. They all had the same um, outfit, attire on. Everything was the same except the head sculpt. There's three different head sculpts. Um, there was this one with the long hair, which I preferred long hair myself. Then there was one with short hair, and then there was one with like a bob in the back. But they all had the same everything. Which I thought was dumb. I mean, personally, I'm over here like, why wouldn't you change her pants or change her change her outfit or give different weapons or something instead of giving me three different heads so we have Buffy which is it's a good show I have Buffy on DVD I have the whole series I also have the whole series of Angel I also have the whole series of Supernatural also has the whole series of Grimm, so what's that say about me? That I like supernatural horror drama shows. That's what it tells you about me, right? That all these best axiom figures always come with this little sticker. Um this is the X also has a stake on the bottom, but this is like that future special X. She also has this stake, which and she has these different hand molds, so you can uh, make her have fists or make her have hands that can actually hold the weapons. All uh, right, now she just has hand shaking hands she has pretty sure it's 360 head articulation this jacket could come off and then it looks like she's wearing a long sleeve outfit um hands are and arms are pretty 360-ish has like it says it has 31 art 
points of articulation. And it does, and it's kind of like some of those. Good thing you can pop her leg back on. For some reason, her feet come off. Uh, so I guess you can switch shoes <laughs> with other best XM figures. She can kick herself in the butt because she actually has that knee articulation there. Um, she, her legs have that turn articulation so she can do a whole bunch of stuff. All in all, she's very poseable figure. You put her in all kinds of poses and you can switch hands and put different weapons in her different hands. So she can be hands-on approach at killing those vampires. Now we're going to open up Angel. Angels we have heard on high, sweetly singing o'er oh, the plains. Goes in his majesty and oh, oh, yeah. And Excelsis Deo. Okay. Um, it kind of has the same buffy artwork here. has a different best axiom sticker or axion keep saying axiom when it's axion axion so in his case he comes with an axe and a sword if y'all remember these are weapons are from special episodes and whatnot the sword's kind of kind of eh bendable so it doesn't look as cool he has extra hands so he can have more like scratchy vampire hands also he has a ring on wonder if that's the ring of you know what he can take his suit coat jacket thing off too has the same Articulation is buffy. Has a head mold that you can pop off and put the vampire head mold on so that he looks like he's all mad and bite you. Same feet, leg. Shoes can come off still. Heck, you could switch her shoes for his shoes. But then that would look weird because he would look like he has little bitty feet. And like I said, he can hold his weapons. So he can go around killing some folks. They can hold each other's weapons too. She can hold his weapons and he can hold her weapons. And you know, so that's the uh, unboxing of the Buffy the Vampire Slayer Best Axion figures. Remember, God is good all the time. All the time, God is good. Keep on gaming. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Jesus loves you. Jesus God. Jesus Lord. Jesus King. Jesus is real. Everything. And of course, comment down below. Um. What should you comment down below? Well, you should comment down below, of course. Any other supernatural shows I should check out? I also have the complete series of Haven. Haven was a pretty cool show, too. So, is there any other supernatural shows I should check out? Horror-ish genre shows, TV shows, um, that you recommend? That I could, you know, watch um, or, you know, find on DVD, watch uh, or whatever. Have a great day. Later.